welcome to Izzy Wizzy Kids Play TV episode number 47 where in conjunction with your weekly play fest on Twitter and on Facebook we are the interactive internet TV show where we're changing the world of toys and play together. I am your host today, Al Boxall Gordon. What is Play Fest? Well, it's your weekly party held on Twitter and on Facebook where you get to share play ideas, review products and give your opinions. Watch the video at izzywizzykids.co.uk forward slash playfest to find more information. Most importantly, come along and join in the fun. Everybody is welcome to Playfest. Now, a couple of weeks ago, your topic in the Playfest was all about the six week summer holidays. And with many children breaking up from school, I'm sure this is a welcomed topic for you. Now, there were loads of play ideas and tips that came out of the Playfest, and I'm going to share them with you in just a moment. But first of all, let's take a look at what Playfest is most looking forward to out of the school holidays. Many of you weren't affected by it as yet as your little ones were still very young, but for those of you with older children, it was quite a transformation in how you manage your time every day. So not having to rush around in the mornings was a, was a bonus. Staying in pyjamas until midday if we want to, enjoying the quality and precious time together, and not having to remember all the stuff you have to remember for school every day. So what were you not looking forward to then about the school holidays? Breaking up those arguments, grumpy kids, the expense, the feeling that all the prices go up at this time of year, entertaining kids 24-7 and everywhere being so busy when you get out and about. So those are some of the downsides and I'm sure lots of you relate to that. So let's take a look at some of your favourite activities then for the summer holidays and hopefully you'll get lots of ideas. So going out on bike rides was very popular having a sports day at home, playing tidy up games, I'm sure that's something that we've, we all could do with doing a bit of that, chasing bubbles in the garden, planning a menu for dinner, dinner creating a shopping list and, and cooking the meal, uh, having a mini theatre and seeing what kids come up with, doing photo hunts, having water fights, having lunchtime barbecues, having trips out to the library, visiting family and friends, uh, having some water play in the garden, Perhaps creating a mini garden within your own garden, going out and about visiting nature with observes, doing pond dipping, making nature collages, doing water painting, getting a, um, a paint chart from a DIY store and searching for items out and about that match up the, to the colours, going to pet shops and looking at the animals there and making bunny, dog and cat masks out of paper plates. So there's lots of imaginative ideas for you there. So what were the top tips given from Playfest for parents about to embark on the school summer holidays? Well the top tips here were don't stress, take it easy and plan a day trip out once a week, chill out and enjoy it, the mess can be cleaned up later, spend as much time as possible outside, have a rainy day option available, have a picnic planned, it can perhaps be done inside and outside, and look at what's going on for free around you, and give the kids just a chance to be, and get bored and fill their time, you don't have to fill all their time, I feel like you're entertaining all the time. I hope you got some inspiration for your school summer holidays from all this. Have a fantastic six weeks break. Do share the fun things you get up to on our Facebook fan page at www.facebook.com forward slash IzzyWizzyKids. And don't forget to join in the Playfest challenge where we're supporting Make Time to Play. Visit izzywizzykids.co.uk forward slash Make Time to Play. That's the number two play. That's me for this week. I'm Al Boxer Gordon. You're watching Izzy Wizzy Kids. Play TV and together we're changing the world of toys and play. It's you with the kids. Hooray!